In this video, I'm going to show you how to add your own voice and your own recording. Remember, uh, you can always change your voice so it doesn't exactly sound like you if you want to make it sound like a different person, uh, but you could do that it, real easily. So the first thing is let's talk about recording. Uh, I have my file and it's saved and I'm going to add a new track and I'm going to use the voice or microphones. Now I have a microphone plugged in. It's not uh, plugged into the computer directly. I'm not using the computer. I am here. The input is uh, not my built in, but I'm using this thing called a Claret Pre. This is mine. You will probably be choosing the internal microphone. Um, I have a, uh, a setup here uh, so that I already have a microphone built in. Uh, that's what you're hearing me through. Uh, so if you're don't have a professional setup like this, you probably want to use the built-in mic. Now on your Chromebook, if you're using a Chromebook, the built-in microphone is going to be a little, little dot at the top of your Chromebook, maybe a little bit off to the right. You're looking for a little hole. Uh, you want to get kind of close to that. Uh, if you have the Chromebook on your lap, remember these are basically laptops. That's fine. If it's on a table just sitting in front of you, that should be close enough. You don't want to get so close that you get something like these airy sounds, I just got really close to my mic. It probably got really loud. And I got all these things called plosives, these air sounds. So it should be sensitive enough to pick you up. But one of the things that um, uh, Soundtrap allows you to do is to do a volume check. You can check your volume by starting a test and uh, use this little test. And what it does is it adds what's called a compressor to the track, and it'll help you from overloading. So go ahead and do that. You start the test, and you just speak. Change the play louder. It wants you to play really loud so you get in the red so it knows what loud is. And then it's done. And what it does is it puts this little uh, preset compression on there uh, for you to use. So I'm actually going to delete that track because it's not going to make my audio sound good. But for you, it will. So don't forget, if you're using the internal, go here and do this. Use this little cog wheel and do this start test. And then you'll be actually ready to record. Now, one of the things you may have noticed on this track is the default setting is to add some panning. Now, what I'm going to do is before I record, I want you to hear, uh, make sure you're using headphones. Yes, you have to use headphones. You could use your little earbuds. You could use plug-in headphones, but you can't use the microphone and the speakers on your computer or on your Chromebook at the same time because the uh, microphone will start picking up what's coming out of the speaker and you start to get this thing called feedback. Uh, we don't want that. So please use some sort of earbuds or headphones. Uh, anything that you use on your phone should work. Um, you have to use plug-in variety. I think on your Chromebook, it won't allow you for Bluetooth, but you'll have to check that out. So here it is. I'm using headphones, good old-fashioned headphones. Old -fashioned headphones. And, you'll hear, and you'll hear, if you do this record, do this enable, record button, enable button, button, you'll start hearing, you'll start I, have hearing I have some kind of back, kind of back. Um, um, stuff there. Stuff it's, there. I'm actually it's, listening, I'm actually to, what listening I'm recording. to what I'm recording. So, um, so you could um, do that, you uh, but you have to have no, record have enabled record on. Enabled you'll hear on. that. But now you'll hear the, now the, reverb. Hear the reverb. reverb. I'm going to turn that off turn that so off. I won't hear the reverb. So That's much reverb. better to That's record better dry to record and add it in later. If you forget, you can always take it out after. So I'm just going to add what I want to add. I can hit the start recording. And I can plan, and I, can I can time it can for time after, it for you know, in the house with the number one DJ, in New York tri-state area, 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 and then I can record then myself, I can or I could just start recording and move it around, because I can edit my own audio as I like. So here we go, I'll try and do this, here we go. Do this, here we go. Spinning the hottest beats in the New York tri-state area. Freeze! DJ Freeze! One, two, three. So I'm going to stop, so let, it stop let it process, and I'm going to turn this off so I don't keep hearing that in my headphones. So.